Keep them through the trees. Tornado off the mark. Era's going to TP straight home. They next him. Yep, they actually did get him. There's the stomp to follow it up. And Hand of God's there. Ravage to try to disjoint things. Era pops the ulti. Has to run. BKB is up. Fnatic. Trying to turn this around. There's the epicenter. Trixie eating a lot of that damage, but only Trixie's eating that damage. No one dead yet. Check that. Trixie's down. Fly going to be hit with the Demonic Purge. Sedoy is there. Has a blink ready if he wants to go for it, and he will. Caught a bunch of creeps and Fly. There's the Exorcism, though, and they're going to have a Burrow Strike onto him. Just can't stand and tank through the damage. It's just one person down throughout all of that action. And looks like it should be fine for Fnatic to withdraw. Era already back at the base. And no, they actually managed to catch Hani. Here comes the Rock following that up. Sedoy misses with the stomp because of the Yules. And now he's going to be hexed. Could turn this around. They have a stomp as well and a silence. And Sedoy, Sunstrike there. And down he goes. There's another Burrow Strike, but Hani's so tanky as his fly. They have no tail with him there too. No mana now for Yul. If they can catch him with a silence, which they should be able to, Using the Crypt Swarm instead, and now the Silence after the Penitence. Test of Faith does a little bit of damage. Solo's there to try and help out. There's a vacuum on all three, and that might be enough. Solo actually going to get hit twice, and now trying to track him down as Hani's leading the pursuit. And he's going to be able to blink, but he blinked into the trees, and he's stuck. Let's see if they realize that they think he made it out to the other side, but he didn't. So they're going to run right past him, Era and Hani. No look. They're going to find a haste rune. Solo doesn't have a TB, but he does actually blink down into the river and reveal himself. In the meantime, here in mid, there's a gush after a hex. On to one. Gold Black's right there with him. Trixie eating a lot of damage. Another blink to get him away. Trixie could be in trouble. Hit with the purge, eating a lot of damage. Coming out from the illusions. Era's now engaging out. And Hani right there on the tail of one. Darkseer in the meantime manages to clean up the tide hunter behind the fight. BZZ pursued by a very fast-moving Death Prophet. Here's Era using the ulti. Ghost Walk should buy him some time as well as the blink. So he'll be able to make it away. Action everywhere on the map just so spread out. They're not done yet. As BZZ trying to TP away. Got hit with no the Yules. Yules. Down he comes and Abyssal just to guarantee. Now back here in mid. There's another Burrow Strike onto No Tail. Sunstrike going to be off the mark. Four Staff got him out of harm's way. And Solo goes in gets the kill. They might be able to catch up with him now as Hani's there. Excuse me, Era's there. Ready to pursue him out along with Fly. And nope, damage not there. Was hoping for a first hit. Bash didn't get it. Rest of Roxkus once again converging elsewhere on the map. But just absolute mayhem across every lane. Arrow wants to re-engage. Hex on the Sedoi. Gold Black uses the disruption to buy in some time. And Sedoi uses the stampede that'll get him away. Gold Black not so lucky. Got bashed and one more auto attack will do it. There it is. One more kill in mid. In the meantime, Hani going toe to toe with Sedoi. Gonna go ahead and use Exorcism. Pursuing him out. Pipe used on both sides. Sunstrike on the mark, and they come back in. Vacuum to bring her down. 100 seconds down. Another hex on the fly up on the high ground. There's the alacrity oh, plus the cold snap. Manages to get a kill there. Lots of burst damage. Trixie has Ravage. Might need it. Burrow struck. All of Rox is gonna converge. He may think about using it as he has help. Nope, gonna turn and gush instead. Rest of Rox pulling back once again. And who knows where the action is going to take place again. Feel like I haven't had a chance to take a breath, but for good reason. These teams playing absolute balls out Dota. Roche now the target. Alacrity on to BZZ. And I'm going to breathe for a second before this next engagement breaks out. Check that. Not going to have time. Trixie moving in. Has a four staff and a, <laughs> and a ravage at the ready. There's a demonic purge on the someone. Didn't hear who it hit. Who it hit. And here we go. Epicenter going up onto the high ground. It's going to catch No-Tail and Hani. There's going to be a Ravage out down in the pit. Roche is still up. They're able to bring down one. Rox only has two standing. Sedoi next to Biden and the ultimate from Fly doing all the work they could ask. Era's going to end up taking the Roche in off this. In the meantime, Rox cleans up one more on the high ground. Solo comes back out and Lycan picks up the Aegis. He's vacuumed onto the high ground, though. He's trapped. Let's see if they can do anything about it. Yo, he's got boots of travel. Coming back out to his creep, ready to pursue down Solo. In the meantime, Yo manages to get another kill. Trixie could be next. Burrow strike up in three seconds. See if he'll have the damage. Uses the urn charge first. He actually cracking out of it. That's gonna keep him keep, that's gonna allow him to keep moving while the rest of Fnatic tries to run protection. Gold Black cannot rush uphill against Era. They're not done yet though. There's a gush now onto Yo. They're gonna turn it around. Scythe Vice used to make room for Era. Coming in and chasing him down into the woods. Burrow strike out by Yol. Solo there with the vacuum. May not have been the best decision. Nope, never mind. Able to get out and able to buy some time for Yol. Let's see if it's enough. Gush slows him down. Era on the on the pursuit. Now there's a Shivas as well. Trixie could end up dead here. They, do they have detection? They don't. Trixie almost dying to the sandstorm. 
unable to do anything to bring him down. And Solo's there with the drive-by mechanism. And finally, they manage to uh, to give us a break for a second as Rox comes out. I don't even. It's hard. I can't even tell you who they won win. that. No, I can't. They win. They have Aegis still on Era, but they got the melee racks top. They also got a tier four tower in their base. Also, that was a humongous. Oh my god, what a play! Like just a series of events.